Hey guys, so I am currently surrounded by loads of beautiful, beautiful autumn winter clothes right now. And I'm really excited to be doing this video because I'm working with Mango on it and I've honestly wanted to work with them for ages. They are such a beautiful brand. So much cool stuff for this autumn winter as well. And also, fun fact, I used to work there. Um, I think I was like 19 when I worked at Mango. Um, maybe 18. I think I was a sixth form at the time. Um, in Chapelfield in Norwich. I don't even know if that store is still there. I've not been into Chapelfield for years, but yeah, I worked there with my friend Maddie and my friend Ellie and we had the best time apart from all of our wages just went back on the clothes because we'd be like in the shop and before it opened when we were just like waiting for people to arrive, we'd literally just be walking around. Actually, I'm lying. Even when there were customers in the shop and I was properly supposed to be working, I was just walking around just mentally shopping, being like, I want this and that and this. And then I would like go and I, I used to have so much stuff on hold and then just wait to get paid and buy it all. So it's pretty cool to, it's now fast forward 10 years and I'm working with Mango on a YouTube video, which is pretty cool. So basically I have picked out lots of gorgeous things for my autumn winter wardrobe and I'm going to show you guys. The stuff that they have in for this season is amazing. The quality of the stuff, the pattern design, the fabrics, the textures. I'm like seriously excited to show you all of this stuff. When I got all of this stuff, I kind of laid it all out on my um, living room floor and have styled it into four different looks because I thought that, that was kind of a more useful way rather than just doing a straight up haul video and being like, I got this and then this and then this and then this. I thought it'd be nice. Oh my God, that made me out of breath. <laughs> so unfit. Um, just doing a bit of this. But um, yeah, so I've styled them into four different looks and then I've already filmed little cutaways of those looks so I can kind of slot them in as I'm talking about the clothes. So that's how I'm going to do this today. Okay, so the first um, outfit starts with this t-shirt. I just love a basic white tee and I just thought this was very nice with the earth on it and um, love just a simple nice design and I'm always a huge fan of like slogan tees and like things with little nice kind of meanings on them. I got this in a medium because I thought that this this is just quite a nice like big oversized t-shirt and then this looks amazing tucked into these leather trousers which honestly I have been looking for so I've always worn like every winter for probably the last like four or five winters I've worn a skinny leather trouser don't know why I'm talking about them singly skinny leather trousers and then my friend Holly recently has been wearing these like baggy um leather trousers and I just thought oh my god I don't know if I could ever pull off baggy leather trousers but it made me think I want some that aren't like stretch skin tight kind of leather. I want some that are a bit like cooler and this is just kind of what's in fashion right now. Um, and these are honestly the perfect ones. They're so flattering. They have like a leather waistband and they are high waisted, have little pockets on the back and they're not as baggy as like my friend Holly's were because honestly I think I'm a little bit too like short and curvy to pull that off. These are a much more flattering version. I'd say they're just like a tapered trouser. Well, you'll see them on me because I'm gonna do the whole like little cutaway thing for you so you can see these clothes actually on me. But uh, yeah, I think they are totally gorgeous. They taper in really nicely at the ankle. These with a jumper or a t-shirt tucked in. I would, even though it's autumn, winter and the weather's getting colder, I will still wear t-shirts, but then the trick is to wear a giant coat over the top. And I found the coolest giant warm coat in mango this oh my god i'm literally in love with it it's like a teddy bear coat actually i put on my instagram story last night when i was kind of like styling all the looks and had them laid out all over my floor and my sister replied to my she sent me an instagram dm and she was like oh my god the teddy bear coat and um she's actually coming to stay in two days so i'm gonna let her borrow it for the day um isn't this amazing? It's so soft. I wish you could feel it. Like it's just such good quality. And I just love a giant coat that you just know is gonna keep you warm. There's nothing worse than being cold in winter, especially if you want to wear things like little t-shirts. And then also with this look, I'd probably have my ankles out and just style it with trainers. Um, Cause I think that looks best with these tapered leather trousers. So that is my first um, look that I've put together. I would say that all of these looks could be 
daytime or kind of evening i'm i'm i have quite casual style in general so i don't have unless i decide to like properly dress up and go crazy um then a lot of the things that i wear i would wear day to night really um but i feel like all of these outfits work pretty well day to night um this one in particular is just like i think of this as slightly like parisian chic this look i have to have one of these in my winter wardrobe i don't know what you call them this kind of like cream jumper when it has a um this kind of knit but i just feel like it's such a wardrobe staple for me and this one is a really nice cut and very very soft and then i think this looks amazing with this little high-waisted leather skirt it's kind of in a similar style to the trousers and that it's belted and has that kind of bit that comes up above the belt which i find really flattering and makes your waist look really nice it's nice because it's n i wouldn't call it a skater skirt because it doesn't go like pff, out like that but it also isn't tight on your legs so it's just like a really flattering quite like straight shape um and i love it and then i am obsessed with this handbag with this look this is what i think kind of like makes it look really kind of parisian and chic just having like a little I also just love these bags where you just like hold them and, and they're like they just look super cute yeah and this is actually a really good size you can fit a lot in here this is the kind of size bag that i like to carry around every day and then for shoes with this look these are going to be my new staple winter boots i think they're perfect and i love the design of them and i just find that these go with everything um I could literally put them with any of these outfits and they'd go these are definitely my top shoes that mango have at the moment i would highly recommend those the next look i've put together is probably the most casual one um also i have not worn black skinny jeans in so long but i saw these and i thought there is a place for black skinny jeans in your wardrobe in winter and i just thought that these were really nice ones and they're stretch because a lot of my jeans when i have like mum jeans or like straight cut jeans i don't like them to have any stretching because i just think it looks better but in the same way that i like to have like tight leather trousers for winter and these new tapered ones um i like to have a black skinny jeans like tuck into biker boots and then you can wear like big bulky like jumpers and coats and you feel like at least there's somewhere on your body that you're making it kind of streamlined um so yeah these have pockets on the bum just like very standard black skinny jeans but they're just really good quality and a good cut um and so as i said i'm gonna pair them with bulky stuff to keep me warm and also it just looks really really cool so these look amazing tucked into the boots that i showed you a minute ago these boots and then this jumper i absolutely fell in love with like you guys know how much I love my knitwear in autumn winter it's like the most exciting thing for me I have way too many jumpers it's crazy um but this one I think I'm like obsessed with the orange in it also I didn't get this from mango but when I was in there I saw they had this like giant orange puffer jacket and that's what they'd styled this jumper underneath and I I almost got it and then I thought oh I don't know how much I will wear it but I actually can't stop thinking about it so i think i'm gonna have to go back and get it i'm planning on wearing this with this big jacket over the top which i also love but now i also want to get the um the orange one so this coat is amazing again it's like a giant teddy bear coat actually maybe my sister was referring to this one when she was talking about the teddy bear coat i guess i've got two giant teddy bear coats i'll have to ask her on which one she wants to wear this weekend but um yeah this just feels like incredible and like it's just gonna keep you so warm and i love the buttons on it there's just something about this with black skinny jeans and boots and any knit underneath or even if you want to brave it a t-shirt underneath um but i do think this looks cute with like a big cozy jumper underneath too and um and i got this in a medium so it would be like nice and you can fit stuff underneath it so that's my third look and then my final look i thought i would do something slightly more dressy but i would still totally wear this in daytime this would be a good outfit to wear if you had like meetings in the day and had to like be running around town and then you had to like go out to like 
an art gallery opening or something like that in the evening or if you had to like go for dinner with friends or I don't know go see a play in the evening or something like that this is like a perfect look for that because you wouldn't feel overdressed in the day you just feel like you look nice um and then it would be perfect to take you into the evening oh my god I just realized I forgot something these sunglasses um also how amazing are they? I love them so much. I feel like now I'm blonde as well. I probably wouldn't have worn red sunglasses when I had um, like Albany brunette hair, but now I have blonde hair. I love them. Oh, and these earrings, these are mango as well. I wear gold hoops every single day. And when I saw these, I just thought these are such nice hoops because they're thick, but they're not massive. And my gold hoops I have that are thick um, are almost a bit too much <laughs> whereas these are like the perfect size for every day so I literally am going to be wearing these every day from now on um yeah these sunglasses look amazing with that giant coat okay so back onto my final look um this oh I've got another pair of sunglasses if it's sunny in the day I just thought these are gorgeous really nice okay so this is the dress so so pretty and it just like is the most beautiful cut honestly like I love the way that it like sits on the waist and it's not like super duper fitted it just kind of like falls in such a chic way I think it's honestly just such a beautiful piece and then obviously to keep warm I would throw probably this giant coat over it I think that would look cool and also that would make it more like casual to wear in the daytime um, and then obviously if you went to something nice in the evening, you just leave your coat in the cloakroom and then be wearing the dress and feel amazing. Um, and then shoe wise, I would honestly wear trainers with that dress um, or like the flat biker boots, but to make it slightly more dressy for this look, I think they look gorgeous with these. I think a heeled patent leather ankle boot is like so kind of staple for winter and then this design is just so cool it looks like um they remind me of like boiled sweets they're just very unique and cool and I feel like they're the kind of boots that people will be like oh my god where did you get those because they they aren't they're like a standard just useful black paint and heeled ankle boot block heel ankle boot but then because the heels are so cool I feel like it just makes them extra great so those are the dress and then this bag oh I think that this just looks so kind of um chic and like I said I just love bags where you just hold them by the little handle and um the texture of this fabric is amazing I feel like I'm doing ASMR now when I'm like holding something close like stroking this that makes a really nice noise um anyway yeah and that and that looks really cool with the big teddy bear coat as well oh and these sunglasses so if it was sunny in the daytime I think these are amazing. Mirrored sunglasses are just such an autumn staple. Yeah, so that is everything that I got from Mango. I hope that this video has given you guys some autumn winter wardrobe um, inspiration or style inspiration. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.